LAPD tweeting that they hear the protesters' pain and their anger, and so did we as we marched alongside them tonight. People of all races, many of them so angry they were near tears as they protested the death. My administration is fully committed that for George and his family, justice will be served. LAPD officers on high alert patrolling the streets of downtown LA. But we cannot allow the righteous cries and peaceful protests to be drowned out by an angry mob. The As their president, I will fight to. Now I ain't trying to be up on the woke shit. Just know that all black lives matter. I had to get up and get on my pro black shit. Fuck with us, we'll put you on the platter. Too many problems. Shout out to Kamala. This change for the better, cause we got it in common. MJB, that's no more drama. Screw the opposition, only worry about them dollars. That's a damn shame. Damn shame. Cause what we really want is some damn change. Just know we gon' stay focused. We tryna dodge COVID in the cops. What's your motive? Damn, if you keep me in the house, bitch, I'm voting. Big picture talk, you got knowledge, then expose it. Loyalty, we show it. Just not for for the moment, time to stand talk right now and forever we see when Pookie shoots Ray Ray, they find Pookie and he gets 25 to life. Officer Johnson shoots a, a Dave, he gets paid leave and nothing happens. That's what we want. We want equal justice for equal crime. We want equal pay for equal work. That's what we want. We want to be treated. If the Constitution says all men are created equal. Well, then why do we have to have all these laws and all these amendments and all these acts just to make sure everybody niggas mad at Drizzy ain't say much, but what the fuck he supposed to say? I'm in Cali, so people asking for K-Dot, but he don't really speak much anyway. Swear to kill Cole and I'm speaking out. So really though, what the fuck is we talking about? Can't blame a celeb with they mouse closed. That's facts, no need try to figure it out. No clout. But as a black man, you should understand that it's more we should learn about. And for the queens, y'all on my mind all day. All respect, all love when I'm speaking now. Yeah. I said we. Yeah. Saying man, yo. This morning, another American city is rocked by outrage over the police shooting of a black man. It's all caught on video. Angry protests led to an overnight curfew in Kenosha, Wisconsin. That's between this Milwaukee isn't even about being Chicago. American, though. It's the bigger than the country, Brian. It's about being a child of God, knowing that something out there is bigger than you, and giving humans the grace that you want God to give you. Because I promise you, the energy that this country gives out will come back. It's all inevitable. A war is coming. And trust me, it won't be man, managed. It will be karma. For eight minutes and 46 seconds. Can you imagine that? He thought he was going to die. He knew he was going to die. He called for his mother. He called for his dead mother. I've only seen that once before in my life. My father, on his deathbed, called for his grandmother. When I watched that tape, I understood this man knew. He was gonna die. He watched it. He filmed it. And for some reason that I still don't understand, all these fucking police had their hands in their pockets. Who are you talking to? What are you signifying that you can kneel on a man's neck for eight minutes? and 46 seconds and feel like you wouldn't get the wrath of God. That's what is happening, is happening, is happening right now, right now.